Yep. Praise the Lord. What about you today? Are you putting your trust and faith in the Word? Are you spending time with God? Amen. Amen. Do you have a relationship with Him? Do you even know His Word? Amen. Do you take time to read it, study, to show yourself approved? Amen. Or you just come in here on Sundays and Wednesdays and get whatever's being fed to you? Amen. Is that enough? No. What did he tell Elijah? He said to rise and eat. One meal wasn't enough. Amen. Amen. He needed some more. Amen. You and I. Amen. It's a journey outside these doors. Amen. We've got to walk through this way of life living as a Christian. Amen. As a saint of God. Amen. As a witness unto a lost and dying world. In God's words, the only thing that's going to do that in our life. Amen. He said that He wants us to be a city upon a hillside that cannot be hid. Amen. Yep. His Word will do that in our life. You and I can't do that. Amen. We can fool some people some of the time, but we'll never fool God. That's right. God knows whether or not we're living according to His Word. Amen. Yes, he, does. he knows whether or not we're serious about serving Him or not. Amen. Amen. Are you serious today? Are you where God wants you to be? Amen. Or do you feel the need to come to this altar this morning and cry out? And ask Jesus to become Lord of your life. Ask Him to help you to put His Word upon the tables of your heart. Begin to meditate upon it day and night and live according to that which He would have you to live. I can't answer that for you. But I can tell you 1995, November the 20th, I made that choice, Brother John. Jesus spoke to me. I was sitting in that little church that night. He said, if you'll come up here and just give me your life, I'll give you mine. I feel the Holy Ghost. I'm telling you, amen, God wants you to come. Amen. Nobody can make you. Wouldn't do them no good if they had to make you. you got to come willingly. See, that's the thing about serving God. God will not make you do anything. He may allow you to get to a place in your life like He did me where I was ready to make a change but I didn't know what I was going to do. I knew I needed help, Brother Hines, but I didn't know where it was going to come from. I'm going to tell you today your help is going to come from the Lord. It's going to come from the Lord. Amen. Jesus said, I'm the way, the truth, and the life. There's no other way except for by me. Amen today. Amen. Things aren't right in your life and you want to make them right. All you got to do is run to Jesus. Don't be like John and run the other way. Coming to church is not going to make you a Christian. No more than going to a chicken house is going to make you a chicken. Amen. You got to be sold out. The Bible says, throw a grain of wheat, fall unto the ground and die. Throw a grain of wheat, fall unto the ground and die. That means, if it don't fall unto the ground and die, it about it alone. Amen. That's saying that's you today. Amen. If you just come and kneel down at Jesus' feet, say, Lord, I'm sorry. Would you please forgive me? <coughs> Come into my life and be Lord of, over my life. Please, Jesus. That's all it takes. When the drawing of His Spirit's there, amen. And He knocks at your door. He said, you're the one that has to open the door. That means you have to run to Him. Sanders got a song. I can tell you, amen, I can feel God's anointing right now in this service, amen. The Holy Spirit's working, amen. If you want to give your life to God, don't wait. You're not going to straighten yourself up. Only God will straighten you up, amen. You just got to be willing to let Him, amen. 
Where would I be? I'm glad you
so good, amen, to feel His presence. Know that we know that we know that He's been here, amen, with us. I want to say that don't forget about Brother Betty Fields having homecoming. Uh, I know it's not too late, it's about 20 after 12. I'm sure they'll be there all day. If you like to go out there, it's real easy to get to. If you don't know how, if you want to know, just get with me after service and I'll tell you how to get there, amen. We appreciate you. Remember these that are praying. Be mindful to them. We dismiss, amen. And let the Lord have his way in our life, amen. Praise the Lord. Appreciate you coming today, amen. We're all dismissed in the name of Jesus. Thank you.